Okay, another question from Christopher. Christopher's last question was great. Let's see how this one is. How often have you participated in a probate or trust litigation where the losing party lost their inheritance due to the non-contest clause you mentioned? Is that a common thing that people face that clause, litigate anyhow, and lose? Have you seen that happen? Yeah, so I, I could recall exactly one case that they actually enforced it against recently. Um, it happens. It happens a lot. Um, but a lot of you got to remember litigation is a long road it doesn't and not every litigation case results in a judgment uh most of them i would say 95 percent of them settle somewhere in the middle right somewhere in the middle we go into a settlement agreement uh mediation something we settle the whole case and then there's no more no contest clause because we settled the whole case everybody went their own ways but should you go to trial and should you get a judgment and even during trial sometimes uh, cases settle. Yeah, I, I know of a case where uh, a guy completely lost everything in his, and he had his substantial assets in there. And the judge, when the judgment came out and said, no probable cause, you're losing everything. And that's just the name of the game. And that's the dice he decided to roll. And uh, it, this wasn't your client. So usually it's the, the client took the advice of the attorney not to litigate. He did it anyhow. And at the end, uh, it didn't work out. So <laughs> I've seen that happen. Yeah. Um, okay, Joe. okay, if you enjoy the video, uh, your next step is to sign up for the webinar by clicking the link above. Uh, and uh, if you have any questions or concerns, go ahead and comment below. Be happy to address them. See you soon.